Fighting corruption is a long-term process, and we all should be involved from an early age by learning values, understanding ethics and morals, taking a stand against practices that we feel are wrong, and more importantly, not engaging in corrupt practices. In 2003, the General Assembly of the United Nations called upon the world community to recognize a day set aside so that each nation can make a commitment to stand against corruption in their society. This is the first year that Grenada is taking part in this activity and it is definitely not only an historical day but a symbolic one as the Integrity Commission marches through the streets of the capital of Grenada accompanied by the churches, accompanied by representatives from the Ombudsman Office, the FIU, the Audit, as well as students coming from different parishes and as far away as Caracou and Petit Martinique joining us today to take a stand to say no to corruption as together and only together can we not only tackle corruption but we can begin the walk of a thousand miles, a thousand steps as we begin to collectively address corruption and to make all of the necessary changes not only to our own attitudes but to to make sure that we implement systems that work to address and to combat corruption in our society the theme for this year is united against corruption for development peace and security so that's what we are focusing on We've decided that since we need to emphasize the importance of fighting against corruption, we need to start with the youth and hence the involvement of our secondary school students this year in the March. We have 12 schools participating, 11 secondary schools, and we should also have TAM CC joining us. When we get to the stadium, there'll be a short rally where we will have a message from the United Nations, a message from the Chairman of the Integrity Commission. The students were asked to prepare posters, so we will be judging the posters and awarding first, second and third positions for the posters. And then finally, we will be launching our logo and mascot competition.